What up? Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It is day 83. Yeah, you heard me. Day 83, Dave's Daily D. Dave's Daily Discussions. You know me. I'm Dave. It's a nice, beautiful Monday morning. I'm sure it's going to get hot. We'll see. Got to roll the windows up while I'm doing the video, though, so y'all can hear me. Guys, just remember, it's Monday. Monday is my favorite day. Just because so many other people throw them away. Today is a day that I'm getting ahead of most people. I'm going to the gym still. I'm getting back into the work week. I'm going to put my head down and get back into it. I'm going to I'm gonna bust my butt hard today. Um, I'm looking forward to try and take this back end, the back nine of the month here to uh, really settle the score and get, get things finished up here for, for work and the career. So we want, we want to put up and produce in that avenue. That's the only timeline I real have. I really have right now, but it's Monday, guys. I woke up. I'm thankful that I got to wake up again. I'm thankful that I get to go to a, the gym. I'm thankful I get to go to work again. There's a lot of things I'm thankful for. And with being thankful, I'm also going to continue grinding and putting in passion, putting in hard work and extreme effort to ensure that I continue growing and building. So remember what we said yesterday in both videos, two things you need to wake up today and bring. Hard work, determination, and everything that you wanna be doing every day. Everything that you're putting in today is one, to be successful, and two, to grow. That's the part that I said in the videos yesterday. You want to make sure that when you wake up today, that everything you're putting time and energy into is to one, be successful, and two, to help you grow. Anything else is probably wasted energy. And uh, I got a good taste of that last week. I, I let myself down, but we don't dwell. You learn from it, you grow from it. You sit behind a slow, eerie black top truck getting on Route 2 going 40 mile an hour. <laughs> um, gotta love sitting behind these trucks with the chance of a window crack. Come on, come on. Pass up, pass up. Alright, we're on the go again. I don't like going slow. So, we, we don't dwell, getting back into that. We do not dwell. Why, why don't we dwell? Well, dwell well. When you dwell, you're sitting still. You're slowing yourself down or you're sitting still. You are not moving forward, you're not, you're typically not accepting if you're dwelling. You're just, sitting there wondering what just happened. So instead of dwelling, you, just, you have to break it down. This is the thing that we've been talking about. You have to break it down. Was it in your control or was it not in your control? If it was in your control, what could you have done better? Learn that, accept that, and be ready for next time. There surely will be a next time. If it was out of your control, well, don't dwell because it wasn't in your control. What is in your control, though, is how you handle it. Do you accept it? Do you let it slow you down and stop you? Oh, it's getting tight here. Um... Do you, do you let it slow you down or do you accept it? Do you grow from it, learn from it, and get ready for that next time? That next time that you have the ability to uh, encounter that situation, you're able to evade or take control 
early enough or take control in the situation that you can you can make it more positive but even though it was maybe a setback or it could have been a loss or some sort of a failure does not mean that it's a negative if you want to turn it into a positive positive all you have to do is search for that silver lining and realize that you can grow from that situation you can learn from that situation that maybe it was meant to be and that next time is your chance so with that being said guys I love y'all I just wanted to put a quick morning video I'm going to try and do another video this afternoon this evening we'll see how the day plays out I really need to start finding doing my things that I'm passionate about but also taking time for me and I've got life insurance I really need to buckle down on that's been super hard to get into with how busy work's been but I love y'all for tuning in thank you for, for taking this journey with me on these these 83 days we've went so far of doing the Dave's daily discussion I'm gonna continue putting out content I just want to motivate you guys inspire you and and for those of you who feel stuck or lost that you're not at the end of the road you just have to think about it figure out what you're passionate about what you love and go after it I'm looking to give everybody that inspiration anybody who is feels like they're in a dead-end job or struggling maybe they feel like they've been stuck in the same spot and they, they're just looking for that breakthrough maybe you're writing a book you're just looking to get to that next point that next maybe you're driving for a goal and you just feel stagnant or lost you don't feel like you're moving forward at this moment just any of that to help you give you that push and that 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 motivation to keep going to go after that goal that you set forth uh so those of you who are frustrated or struggling, hang in there. Watch these videos. Bear with me. I promise that we're going to get through it together. I love y'all. As much as I'm trying to be successful and I'm growing myself, I'm also trying to help y'all be successful and help you grow as well. And all of you guys being successful and me seeing you be successful in turn helps me more because I'm watching you grow. My passion is to help others. So every time I can reach out and help somebody, give them a little extra push, a little extra motivation, a little extra love, that uh that's huge for me so love y'all it's monday tgim thank god it's monday thank god i'm awake again i am blessed for that i am i'm grateful and just remember guys as every other day it is self-love and positivity i love y'all let's have a wonderful day make sure you're doing the right things to win today i am i'm going to the gym i'm going to work because i get to go to the gym and i get to go to work and uh I'll tune in with you guys later. I love y'all. Thank you for tuning in.